Welcome to Fraser Heights Secondary School, a place we are proud to be a part of and excited to be able to share with you. The Ministry of Education in the province of British Columbia has recently selected Fraser Heights Secondary to be an innovative school. We are pushing the boundaries, bringing in inquiry-based learning, and finding ways to better engage our students in their learning. We are embracing the new BC Education Plan, which is a way of modernizing the way that we teach our students. Fraser Heights Secondary has done so much from the academic achievements to social responsibility and the teamwork and leadership opportunities that is provided within these uh, rooms and halls to all and every single one of the students. We have a lot to celebrate, a lot of awards that we are carrying with our, our students' involvement, but mostly I am so excited with the, what future brings forward for us. Um, I can't wait to see some of the new programs to get up and uh, actually make an impact to our students. years, a couple of years actually, transforming our library into a learning commons. And that basically means that it's a place where students, teachers, um, people in the community come to share, collaborate, create, connect. Um, it is a maker space. New this year, we are offering an innovative and integrated approach to teaching Grade 8 Humanities, Math and Science through inquiry-based learning. Also in Humanities, another class is doing Genius Hour, which is having the freedom to create, discover and explore your passion and share your voice beyond the normal limits of the classroom. It is also inquiry-based. Fitness classes offer personalization in that the girls can choose their own fitness plan. Our Biology 11 students offer a pond program to grade 4 students who are part of our family of schools. It's so great to see older students and younger students all learning together right here on our own campus. The University of Toronto says that Fraser Heights Secondary is one of the top 50 high schools in all of Canada. Our students excel at science and math. Our future plans include establishing a science academy for students in grade 11 and 12. At Fraser Heights, our students work in technology-rich learning environments. It's been a pleasure to introduce the iPads to our school, and they do a great deal to help improve student learning. The people and all the teachers here some really good teachers. Yeah, and people. Yeah, and uh, just super good environment. Yeah. yeah. What's um? What about the way that you learn here and you, when you say about your teachers, like what is it about your teachers that you think is really great? I don't know, I moved here like two and a half years ago and the school I was going to before taught a lot different, like I don't know, like just writing notes and stuff like that and that mm -hmm. was like more inquiry based. Yeah, You're more they like interact. They, they interact. They're not so pushing. Yeah. You know, like, and also using technology because a lot of us are more technology yeah. now, it's kind of like, it's easier in yeah. a way. Because we work What is the technology? It makes it easier yeah. and makes us not, not, being able to not expand. Not easier, it just makes it more enjoyable to do. Yeah. How so? Um, just just like it's better than writing on a piece of paper. You can get like more work yeah. done faster and like... Like an iPad is more enjoyable than a lined piece of paper in a pen. Or just a computer. Like it's, it's, it's easier to work with. 
International students come from all over the world and choose Fraser Heights Secondary as a great place to learn. Our Spanish teacher finds an engaging way for students to learn language and culture while making paella. At Fraser Heights, we have a fabulous vocal jazz group and concert choir, as well as concert and jazz bands who have won numerous gold medals at various national and local festivals. In their grade 11 year, students take a Social Studies 11 and Work Experience combined course so that our students are all gaining valuable community and work experience. These grade 8 students are participating in the National Can Spell Contest. Special needs students are supported in their learning. Clubs are a huge part of student life at Fraser Heights and we have more clubs to offer than almost any school. A huge variety and we hold a clubs day each October so that students get a chance to see all of the different clubs that they can join. Model UN and the debate club are some of our biggest clubs. These clubs have over 75 student members. I cannot be more excited to share some of our achievements and awards um, in academic, in the sports, and leadership and social responsibility. This school has provided valuable lessons and opportunity for development for every one of the students. This is just a sample of what we have and this is the most recent one that was achieved in a debate tournament, biggest debate tournament in BC. Our multi-talented students hold coffee house fundraisers to support students in Malawi, Africa. Our student council demonstrates outstanding student leadership. Our student council organized numerous events not only to build spirit within our school, but also to make valuable contributions to our community. Our catering club creates wonderful meals for student activities like Aboriginal lunches and international lunches, all made by students. At Fraser Heights, we excel at badminton, volleyball, and hockey. Last year, our badminton team came first in the province. This year, our senior boys volleyball team is ranked first in BC as well. School spirit soars at Fraser Heights and during our spirit week called Five Days of Fire, this is even more so, even more spirit. Our grade 12s enjoyed a grad boat cruise earlier this year.
At Fraser Heights, we love grade eights and we do our best to welcome them to our school and help them to belong to our school very early on. In September of each year, we have a grade eight retreat, this year held at Camp McLean. It's an opportunity for our grade eights to get to know each other, get to know our school, and also to have a chance to work with our leadership students for a day of lots of fun activities. Our teaching staff are finding Twitter to be a great source of learning, of sharing, and collaborating with others all over the world. Teacher learning is just as important at Fraser Heights as student learning, and each month we hold meet and eat sessions, often bringing in guest speakers to help teachers with their own learning. George Kuros, Division Principal of Innovation and Learning in Parkland School District in Alberta, has helped us a great deal on our learning journey, teaching us about Twitter, blogging, and using social media in our teaching. This year we created a WordPress blog called FH Learn and we have all of our staff and all grade 8s on our blog. Please join us there. Find us at fhlearn.ca. By having all of our students getting on to the fhlearn.ca blog, we are providing an opportunity for our students to create and learn and share their learning with others and larger audiences outside of our school. We also take time at our school to teach our students responsible digital citizenship our grade 8 students are developing electronic or e-portfolios. Our future plans at Fraser Heights include establishing a science academy at the grade 11 and 12 level, a junior pilot at grade 8 and 9 that involves humanities, math and science and looping those students for two years. In addition, we have a new a additional space coming to Fraser Heights, bringing us many more classrooms in the next year or so. Thanks for letting us share our Fraser Heights story with you. <laughs>